All right, let's get into the weekly watch report where we talk about the things we watch this week. Weekly watch report, boom, boom. Weekly watch report, boom, boom. Remix. Coming to you live with the weekly watch report. Oh, <laughs> love that, that one. That was going somewhere for a that minute. That was. And I Coming got to you live with the weekly, weekly watch report. report. Oh, that's a tongue twister, though. Coming to you live. It was going somewhere. Yeah, it was. And then I got nervous. Coming to Coming you Coming to you live with the weekly watch report. Noah's got a long list. That makes us bored. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. That, I, wasn't trying to, I wasn't trying to start off on that foot. I wasn't. <laughs> All right. What do you got? Probably nothing. <laughs> <laughs> um, suits, which I've slowed down on, um, but I did watch a lot this past weekend. Yeah. I don't even know how much I watched. That's how much I watched. Yeah. Probably a full season of some sort. Got to the season finale of season two and whoa, took my breath away. Don't Cliffhanger. Spoil. I'm uh, not. No, it was just, yeah, kind of. It yeah. was like, what the fuck just happened? By the way, do you want to tell everyone that your mom spo- spoils? Oh my God. We were on FaceTime with my parents <laughs> and my mom let out a major spoiler, yeah. which I will not repeat, yeah. but a major spoiler. And we were not happy. <laughs> we were not happy. And my mom was like, no, no, not that. And we were like, we know what you just said. Yeah. And she was like, oh, who cares though? <laughs> and we were like, clearly, yeah, you don't care because you know what happens. Yeah. Yep. So we were PO'd. Um, but yeah, I was shocked at the end of season two. Uh, I'm going to give it a, a B. B. I'm going to yeah, keep it where it's been. A to a B. What? You gave it an A last time. Well, at first, the initial, I think the last time I did, I gave it a B because the first time I did, I gave it an A. Or was the last time we're talking about it? This is the second time we're talking about it? For Weekly Watch Report, I think. Okay, I'm going to give it a B, though, because, but I did say during it that I was like, it really deserves a B, but because of my excitement, I'm giving it a B. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to give it a B because my excitement has died down. I do like season two, though. I'm I'm in the. Oh, I'm still enjoying it, yeah. It's like more where Harvey's like. There's more stuff personal. There's stuff a more on. personal, like inner stuff going on. I want them to get back to the cases. Mm. I'm kind of the opposite. <laughs> um, let's solve some crime here, right? You want more of like a law and order? Vibe. Yeah, let's settle. Yeah, let's settle some shit. Yeah. Um, I'm gonna give it a B. Okay. Only murders is back. Oh, fuck it is. Wait, what? Yes. Today. The new season. Oh my god! No, it came back on Tuesday. Oh. Fuck. August 8th, where have you guys been? Oh my God, uh, honestly not paying attention. Ah! Are you kidding? Did you watch the whole thing? Is it week to week? Two episodes are out. Oh shit. I gotta <laughs> watch. Oh my God, I can't believe you didn't even text us that you were watching. Someone like you. I had a I really bad migraine. Yeah. You know, how I, I know I've said this now three episodes in a row, or maybe four at this point, that I was getting sick. Yeah. I'm, Still lingering? No, no, I, I think it's gone now, oh. but I like really, I don't know what happened. Tuesday night. That happens to me sometimes. I felt I had maybe the worst my like, I say headache, but I'm pretty sure it was a migraine. No, it's like where you have to like turn off all I the had lights. To and shut the, off yeah, everything. Yeah. Bury my head in a pillow. Yeah. I couldn't even eat dinner. I don't know what. And I was like, this feels like what has been building up for the past week. Mm. This this illness that I'm not sure what it is. And oh my god, I felt awful. But before that, I did watch Only Murders. Oh my god! I can't believe I didn't talk to you. I'm, I'm shocked. I'm so it, greedy. Like I was gonna say, very unlike you to not bring this up at any point during the week. I'm so greedy. I want to Martin Short all myself. Yeah. Freaking love him. <laughs> um, I'm unsure what to grade it. Okay. Oh, it makes sense that we don't hear about it because it's the set. Like no one's talking about anything. Yeah, there. I mean, yeah. right? There's, like, no, there's no press. I'm promoting it. Yeah, I'm. I'm leading the promotion for only which, murders, like, and I haven't yeah, been. Yeah, which apparently is, is apparently bad. bad like, right? No, um, apparently it's bad. Apparently it's bad because I didn't. That it's bad, but it's like, what, what? are we supposed to do? Oh, oh, I thought we were talking about me promoting. That, no, words. it's like that that influencers and people like to support the actors shouldn't also shouldn't. Oh, we talk shouldn't about talk about the shows, but I mean, oh, we have a whole segment. We have a whole segment. For it. Yeah, and, we I, and, I, TV and shows. at the end of the day, people are going to watch TV. Yeah, we're still going to watch know? TV. Unfortunately, you know? we, we do support them, but one hundred percent, we are still going to watch. TV. And a little bit of part, a little part of me like also thinks that a lot of actors still like they want people to still watch what I they, mean, put they put out you know yeah, they put the work yeah, in they want exactly. them to watch um yeah i mean i just love martin short so much <laughs> i genuinely like it you really, really should read his book I, i'll bring my oh yes I'll bring yes book please do it's so good i forgot about that please. memoirs ever i i get like giddy seeing the three of them on screen together yeah, yeah. they're my favorite little <laughs> cast they're like like that's why i feel like i feel like i haven't talked favorite about it because they're mine murder solving trio i if their podcast was real 
in real life, I'd be their biggest number one fan. You'd be in that group. I'd of be the in the crazy group, like, fans yeah, standing outside, the being like, "Please!" And then Martin being like, "Not now! I must get my dips." Honestly, and I'd be like, "Yes, King!" Surprising that they don't have a real podcast. They they don't not like a belt cry, but that that just would like be, two the of three them. of them yeah. would be magic. It would be kind of meta. But also, but it doesn't have to be. They don't need the, same. the thing is the three yeah. of them don't need to make a podcast. They don't. No, they don't. We we need a podcast to survive. Well, now they might. This is our only means of living. Is this yeah, podcast? True. What else have they got going on right now? Um, I guess Selena. I don't know. Probably music, I don't know. Let's talk about the show no, though. Yeah, Meryl Streep, yeah. Paul Rudd, star-studded cast. In this in this season, I mean, like shivers down my spine as soon as I clicked play. Amazing. So I'm just gonna give it an A, even though, like, I honestly the the first two episodes, in my opinion, like they always start off like yeah. a little slower. Um, but I'm giving Only Murders an A because they're just the best little trio oh, yeah. and all the surrounding parts. Paul Rudd, Paul Rudd calling Meryl Streep a stink of Rooney. <laughs> so like in this, Meryl Streep's an actor. Yeah, and Paul Rudd's like she stinks like yeah. his character is like she stinks so like <laughs> just thinking about Paul Rudd saying that Meryl Streep stinks is hilarious I yeah. love it I love Wait, it did they release the whole show at once no, no just two episodes, two episodes. Oh, you two episodes. clearly weren't fucking paying attention you're fired <laughs> <laughs> so, oh you know what wait till trivia on Monday to see who's not paying attention once again oh my god I listening. totally slipped <laughs> I know it almost feels like Weekly Watch Report is like I get like a new set of balls come on and I'm like I'm like you're fired Noah <laughs> I don't know. I'm just having fun. Just happy to be here. Just joshing. I really am just happy to be here. I've had, just I've had a giddy week. Yeah. Um, especially because Only Murders is back and I kept it to myself. Yeah, seriously. <laughs> I, that's really the biggest. I am I truly am <laughs> shocked you did not text us. Also, you know what I watched? This is not a TV show. I watched like, this last night. That is night. the prime time for you to come in here and sit in that scene and be like, I know we only talk about shows during the weekly watch report, but I just got to say, Only Murders is back. That's a great impression. Well, we have our- I'm joking. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, you're looking for it, buddy. I was going to say, but no way, you're, <laughs> ra- you're asking for a knuckle sandwich over there. Yeah. Should I go noogie? noogie? Yeah. <laughs> Noah's head. Take your hat off. Um, Take that off. <laughs> um, what was I going to say? Oh, I watched something. <laughs> that it was was not a TV show or movie. Yeah. I texted the group about it last night. Nobody answered, which is a common theme I in was our at a chicks, concert. Our chicks in the office group Wait. chat is me sending texts and nobody answered. I was me. at a concert. Um, no, I, I gave a pass to you, but okay. it was meant for you solely. Well, sometimes it I know it's me? not meant for yeah. me, so I'm not like I oh, honestly could, I couldn't even tell you what it was. That's how much I didn't read the text. <laughs> like sometimes I read them and yeah, like yeah, I yeah. register and mm-hmm. I don't respond like I know I'm not responding but mm-hmm. like this one I don't even know what you said no that's fine listen you were having a grand yeah time. I was I'm not gonna hold it against thank you thank you um you know how I love the W Magazine ASMR yeah guess who did one? Oh wait now I do remember um shit oh my god uh now this is like a test cause you did send it Somebody. No, but I know you didn't read it, so I'm not gonna be mad. No, at you no, no, knowing. no. But I, I, I did look at it. Um, Come on, your guy, your boyfriend. Oh, 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 uh, James Marsden. James Marsden. Jimmy Marsden. Yeah. Fantastic. <laughs> yeah. Fantastic ASMR. Wow. And I watched it in bed next to my loved one. I said, "Excuse me, I gotta watch this." Yeah. yeah. I said, "I, if you don't Give mind, me a moment. I'm gonna turn." And James Marsden did a W Magazine ASMR, yeah. and I said. I have to watch this. And it was great. So you and James Marsden were in bed together. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, no, it was actually just very interesting. Um, yeah. Or not even, entertaining. It was yeah, very yeah. good. It was entertaining. And he was very good at ASMR. And so I'm rating that an A+. Plus. Maybe they're listening. Wow. Maybe they're listening to you more Maybe. about the W because magazine. I will- you're, you're, you're out here screaming from the rooftops that they do not do those videos enough. Listen, I will watch any celebrity ASMR. Like, yeah. I watched... Carol G's last night. Mm-hmm. I don't listen to her music. <laughs> is, who's, is that the girls' players? She's a singer. Too? She's a singer. What? No. She's. Because girls' oh, players. Too. Is that no, her? no, no. I don't know why I thought that was no. her. No. She has a song with the Jones Brothers. Oh. Um, <laughs> But I watched hers. I was like, why not? You know? Yeah. Um. I watch it? anybody who does it. Great, they're yeah. all good. I, they need them to. They need to get people to do it more often. Yeah. I saw Austin Butler did. An interview with W Magazine, but he didn't do the ASMR. Austin Butler would be great at the ASMR. Yeah, yep. Elvis knew he Sam's would, ASMR. Yeah, what are you doing over there, W? Of, like, what? He would get a lot of jokes if he did that, probably. 
Yeah, but it would be awesome. But it would be great. He would he would do really well, I think. So that's what I watched this week. Love. Yawn. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I know, I'm so boring. I, um, okay, so what did I watch? I watched... Oh. Not only now murders. I, 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 didn't, I didn't. I had no fucking idea. Well, <laughs> well, my best friend didn't text me to say it came back. <laughs> On Tuesday. They dropped it midweek. Yeah, mid-week they didn't even mean, wait till Friday. They didn't even fucking say anything. <laughs> um, <laughs> Stop laughing like that. <laughs> <laughs> That's more of your laugh. What is that? <laughs> like, what is it's that? like a gotcha. <laughs> That oh that God. laugh is not that was a that, gotcha laugh. I that is a, it's like a gotcha it. laugh. It's like a <laughs> <laughs> gotcha suckers. I was watching it. You weren't. <laughs> um, Marvin Short's all mine. <laughs> I, I watch. Okay, so now He's everybody's not like you when we meet him. Everybody's <laughs> everybody finished Love Island UK. It's out on Hulu, so I don't care about spoiling anything now. Um, and we talked about it with Girl Boss Town also, but. The whole season, you know, it was just very interesting to me. I really... Didn't you talk about this yeah, last I thought you, week? You talked about it last week. No, I didn't say who won. Oh, it's, but you graded We it. did talk about who won last week. We talked. I talked about it with Girl Boss Sound, but Weekly Watch Report last week, I didn't say who won because it wasn't out yet for UK. Really? But you graded it, right? Yeah, I did. Really? I'm pretty sure. Man. I don't know. I could be wrong about that. We talked so much. I, myself, I but, cannot keep track. But I, I thought I, it was that, more that I was floor Justin Sammy won, truly. Very surprised by it. I'm surprised too. Um, I only watch half of the season. Yeah, honestly, that's really like I, I think I've, I've really explained my show. No, 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 no. I'm just saying. I think I've oh. I think I've really shared a lot of my thoughts for that one. Love Island, USA. I am one episode behind at the moment, but they just started costing more. I look. This is going to be my complaint about Love Island, USA, until they change it, and I don't know if they will. But it's not enough episodes. They need to do a UK style. I don't know why UK is the only- Get a life. I don't know why. (laughs) Do more episodes. I don't know why the UK is the only one that does like the 60 episodes or whatever the hell it is. But that is the only way that it feels like there are actual connections being made. We're on a Casa Amor this season. Started like episode 18. It's not enough episodes. You don't think- no. 18 days in the villa? No, Casa Moore needs- 18 days to fall in love? UK Casa Moore starts like thir- in the 30s. Push, or like high yeah. 20s. And every single day counts. Every single day matters to build those connections. And even if it's like every single five days- Every day is day, like a week. Right, even if it's like five days later, that's so much more time. And I just feel like they don't, They sh- it should be longer. It should be longer. You can get more contestants in. I think people get invested more into it. They do it so fast where it's not a surprise that barely any Love Island USA couples have actually survived. The show's so short. They got to fix that. Because otherwise, I'm I'm very entertained at the moment, I will say. Um, I don't necessarily like... It's another situation where I'm not like in love with any of the contestants. Um... So it's, you know, it's interesting to see. And there will be drama for the recoupling, I'm sure. But God, you need to make it a little bit longer. I'm going to give, I'm going to give it a, a, I'm going to give it a C plus. It's good, but you know, it's like low, okay, mid to low 70s. Um, I watched the first two episodes of the new season of Sweet Magnolias, which took you a long time. It's one of those shows yeah, I haven't had a lot of me time um, with like my TV shows. Oh, you know, <laughs> no, it's just that like, like to watch your your yeah. Well, you spend it all watching Love Island. I do, I really do. Um, and so like at night, Joe and I are watching stuff that we want to watch together. Mm-hmm. Joe's not the kind of guy that'll like sit in front of the TV and watch whatever I'm watching. Like he'll watch four minutes and then be like, turn this off. Mm. So we always like end up watching something that we both agree we want to watch. And I save my programs for me time. Mm -hmm. So one night I did get some time where I could watch, I watched two episodes of Sweet Magnolias. Um, I don't know who's watching this. I'm obviously tons of people watch it. It's always high up in the Netflix count. But this was another one that kind of like popped up. I had no idea a new season was out. It's so like cheesy, 
but keeps me captivated all at the same time, you know? I'm like, what are these ladies going to do? Is Helen going to end up with Ryan or the other guy? I like the other guy so much more. Is Donna Sue? Oh, fuck, I forget what her name is. Something Sue. Donna Sue? I think it's Donna Sue. They got all this money now. What are they going to do with it? It's just like very, at its core, like simple, small town drama, but done in a very uh, good way, I think. So I enjoy it. I'm going to give it a... <laughs> sue me. <laughs> sue me. I'm going to give it a B. I've only watched two episodes, but um, I'm excited to see what happens. You know, are the moms finally going get, to get along so these kid, these high school kids can have their relationship? Their moms hate each other. They, they're, they're forbidden to date each other. That's the kind of level we're at, you know, where mm. it's like very simple. But watch that. Give it a, what did I just say? B? Yep. Yeah. Um, I'm caught up on Real Housewives of New York. Oh, I'm not. Good reminder. Yeah. Thank you. Um, I will give that. I will also give that a B. Very much enjoying it. I'm, I'm locked into getting to know these ladies. I, perfect example of like judging a book by its cover. You know, I think Bryn was a character that everyone immediately was like oh she's gonna be annoying mm -hmm. but we learned a lot more about her background on these last couple episodes quite a life she's lived and just hearing more of her story um is fascinating and honestly probably explains a lot of like why she acts the way she acts too which is just interesting um i'm i'm invested i think uh there's one. Why am I forgetting her name? Just Gis Giselle? Jessel? Yes, I think that's her. Now, she is maybe just annoying. <laughs> like, I think, <laughs> I don't know. I feel bad because everyone feels that way. And, like, I think everybody feels like she's trying too hard. Like, it's like, oh my God, I'm on the Real Housewives of New York and now I need to, like, put on a show. She was gifted this lingerie. Everyone was gifted lingerie. She got something that she really didn't like. She didn't shut up how, about how much she hated it the whole night. It was like so rude. Mm. And even, honestly, it was a crazy quote. Even her, she hasn't had sex with her husband in a year. Um, That's not good. Not good since she, they had kids. And, but her husband, they were just having a conversation with her husband. And her husband was like, you do come off like the wrong way. Like all the time. <laughs> Not good. It was just like a crazy thing to say yeah. to just be like, yeah, you know, I kind of don't blame the ladies because right. you are, you, you do like, you are kind of an asshole sometimes. Yeah. Not something you want to hear from your husband. No, kind of wild thing for him to say straight to her face. Um, but I am, I'm totally enjoying it. I watched the first episode of Hard Knocks, which I have not watched in a while, but it's the Jets. And Joe's a big Jets fan. He's very nervous about this season. Very nervous. A lot of hype behind the team. You know? like they He's do. very nervous. I, you know, I don't know. It's a Jets. For the sake of my fiance, I will. I'm rooting for him. You know, I hope that they do well. Um. So we watched the first episode of Hard Knocks. Came out, and it re reminded me how much I do really love Hard Knocks. I think it's a great show. Great production. It sucks because they were kind of they touched on it a little bit in the episode, and I feel that way about quarterback also which I still have not finished, but the players really don't want to do these shows, a lot of them, because they think it's like a big distraction. Like I was reading that they're having a really hard time casting the second season of quarterback because none of the guys want to do it. If I was a coach, I'd be like, no. Mm -hmm. like, yeah. It seems I, like it only is a yeah, distraction. Yeah, I don't know. So obviously the Jets are doing hard knocks and um, it's a big thing because – a lot these last few seasons it feels like they've really picked teams that don't have the big name guys but Aaron Rodgers is as big as it gets right so having him be a part of it is huge and um talking about it and were the Jets picked before he does he does just I don't know he does seem like a cool guy Aaron Rodgers was on the Jets like I wonder if it was no I don't think so so maybe I don't know but I, I doubt it um so I, I'm gonna give that I'm gonna give that first episode a B plus really liked it laughed it was entertaining. I love, I do enjoy Hard Knocks. Um, and I think that, I think that is everything. I'm trying to think if, oh, no, it's not. Started the third season of Righteous Gemstones with Joe. Also forgot about that. One of the funnier shows mm -hmm. always makes me laugh. I watched the first 
two episodes, three episodes, first three episodes of season three. Very funny. Um, always enjoy it. That's like a, that's an A minus show for me. Yeah, um, it's always I, funny. It's really, really good. And it's one of those shows that everyone talks about in a way that they're like, this show is so underrated. And that's like the commentary about this show is mm -hmm. that it's so underrated. And it really is. It I is very funny. Absolutely think it's hilarious. Now that is everything I've watched. Okay. I don't have that much. Sure. <laughs> no, I really don't. <laughs> I just have one strong recommendation. Oh, full uh, circle. No, <laughs> did hi over. did hijack end? Hijack did end. Wait, yeah, did right. I talk you about that? Yeah, no, yeah, yeah, you did. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah I talked yeah. about the finale. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I I watched one episode of this new show, This Fool, which is on Hulu. Okay. Uh, getting great. It has a hundred percent on Rotten Tomatoes. Um, but it's like a com it's just one episode. I only watched one, but oh. the whole there's two seasons out, so I don't know. The new season just came out. I guess I just missed the first season when that came out, but. The only person that you would know in it, I think, is um, Michael Imperioli. Oh, yeah. I saw that. I saw a promo for that. Yeah. yeah. It's funny. It's definitely funny. I just only watched one episode, but I, I'll give it a B minus. Like, I, I enjoyed it. I didn't love it. Okay. But maybe it'll get better. Um, I did watch a ton of Suits. Suits has become my show that I just kind of like right. put like any- Instead of putting a shitty movie on in the yeah. background, yeah. you're putting yeah. on yeah. Suits. Yeah. Like, Suits is just Wow, on. we freed up some time. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thank God. <laughs> Uh, I'm on episode nine of season two right now, and You're yeah, on I, episode nine of season. Oh, so you'll get to the finale of season two soon. Yeah, and maybe actually, maybe there's six. Yeah, there's like some. I don't know. It's like some episodes I'm very invested, in, and then some I'm like, ugh, like Same, I'm, I don't. I, I don't it, it goes back and forth. Yeah. Like sometimes my attention is like it's all I want to see, yeah. and then I'm like, how long uh, is Meghan Markle on it? A lot. Still of, season eight. I was gonna say. Oh, really? Almost the yeah. whole thing. Oh shit! Just the last two seasons, she's not on. But yeah, I'll give that a B again. Like, it's just a solid show and yep. entertaining. Mm -hmm. All right, this is the last one that I have, but wow. I, want, the, every, I the, want everyone to watch this is it. The big, okay? like, every, this is wants the everyone's big attention. Whammy. Yeah. I was telling this thing Sarah on? and Gia <laughs> earlier about it. It's called Chimp Empire, and it's on Netflix. It's four episodes. I've watched three. It is insane. Is it, fast? Like, is it it's about, a, it's about monkeys? It's Chipmunks? about chimpanzees. and you, So they're in the... <laughs> Wait, did you say? Did you say chipmunks? <laughs> no. Did you actually just say chipmunks? Yes. She said, no, I didn't. She said chipmunk chipmunks. <laughs> Honestly, imagining a show about chipmunk empire. <laughs> Tears coming from my eyes. My Chim brain vampire. when Chim Chim <laughs> leads a chipmunk. Chim chipmunks. That's, oh, that's crazy. Right. You just flip the M and the P there, you know? Chipmunk. Chimp. Chimp. Oh, I didn't hear it. You said... Uh, chimp empire. Chimp empire. Okay, I thought you said... Chip empire. Chimp empire. So that was just a, that was just a mishearing. Oh, uh, sure, sure. No, it chip was. Monks. I thought you said chip empire. And I was like, is this a show about chipmunks? Because I'm in. <laughs> you know who fucking loves monkeys, though? Oh. Marty. Tr trust me. Lo he will. You don't even have to. He this, will, he loves just like, anything having to do with like monkeys and oh, chimpanzees. I mean, chi chimps. But then anyways, get on this. It sounds. So like. Are the chipmunks ch real? <laughs> yes. What? Okay. Thank God. Chipmunks what? are an animal. Okay. Thank God. I thought by the reaction that I. No, I it's just like crazy in that what they're not world real. Am I like no. you guys have to watch this? <laughs> like empire. Like yeah. No, empire? it's just more that like uh, that like people would be out here calling chi chipmunks chimps. <laughs> I yeah. just I heard. Oh chip. look, that's a cute chip. <laughs> <laughs> I hear a chip. Oh I, god, I, I do I love chipmunks. Honestly, though. pictured a bunch of evil chipmunks. Alvin and the Chipmunks. <laughs> yeah, chipwrecked. I, I, movie. I pictured like evil chipmunks taking over. Yeah. Okay. Anyway, so sorry. it's all. I'm sorry to interrupt your. Yes, and the, he wanted to be suggestion. so serious about yeah. this. Yeah, he. Yeah, he's like, he's like, can we get back yeah. to the chimp empire? Yeah. Sorry, go ahead. Right, I am so actually very it's interested. Four episodes, and I've watched three. It's set in a jungle in Uganda where there's like, m like so many monkeys, uh, chimpanzees. Uh, they follow like this one family uh, tribe, I guess you would call it. Like, yeah. like, like, mm -hmm. yeah. So there's different Pack. like, so different uh, sections in the jungle like are owned by different groups, and chimpanzees like don't fuck with each other. Like, if you're not in their group, so 
but they need like I, I'm trying to describe it in a way like it's basically like a reality show where like <laughs> about you, but like you know because they I name chimpanzees are literally am, bad, but they name they everyone. might as well be humans so I am each, so, like it's Noah, crazy I, I promise you I am watching this tonight, tonight. Each, like each, there is no doubt in my mind we are so yeah, it's banging narr- out four episodes tonight. <laughs> Like each chip, uh, I'm fucking saying chipmunk. <laughs> <laughs> so each chipmunk, <laughs> each chimpanzee has a like, and they give them a name, and, and like I have my favorites. So like I, I'm like I, I really like this one. I feel bad for this one. Like oh my uh, goodness, and like Tech it's Marty about it's this. very like it feels fake because first of all I don't understand. Like I tried to research like how did they film because it's so close. It feels like a a, a fake movie. Like yeah, yeah. you're in it, and I guess that they just like don't care about humans being there or they're just used to it they just are it, so well, maybe, in what if, it what if they set up cameras like, no trust me they're not. i saw behind the scenes Netflix. they're like oh, like they're there's like actual humans carrying cameras yes around. there's like uh like full-on like wars going on like monkeys like beating the shit out like killing each other like <laughs> yeah. is this on netflix it's on netflix and <laughs> they're like and you're like, it's you that good. Is it new or? It came out in 2023. It's it's oh. narrated by, so the whole thing is narrated by Mahershala, Mahershala Ali. Yes. And it's like very, com- his voice is so calming. He's got a great voice. And like, so it's, his is, his voice is the only voice you hear the entire yeah. time. So he's mm-hmm. just narrating what you see. And like, so, so like episode one, you follow like this one You know what I really episode did? Two. I, I, I feel like I saw this as a top show on Netflix for a while. It has 100% around it. Like it's, a, it's incredible. Like not necessarily recently but maybe in the last like month or so ago and being like what is this the, i am the baby this the tonight. baby chimpan- chimpanzees are so cute like oh, i cannot I'm wait in. to watch i'm so I'm in. It, it's only four i have one left yeah i literally like the past two nights You're like saving the last episode. would just like smoke and walk and i'm like this is insane i cannot believe just from a production standpoint alone it's like how did they do this yeah, yeah. i can't but wait you get really invested like I don't want to spoil things, but some of it's sad. Yeah. All right, don't spoil. I won't spoil, but uh, <laughs> bless you. Yeah, no, it's 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 incredible. All right, wow, Chip, Chipmunk Empire, <laughs> Chipmunk Empire, <laughs> tuning in. I'm actually. I'll give that I'm, an A plus. I'm sold on that. Yeah. I'm, wow. I'm okay. definitely going to tune into that. Sounds good. Um, yeah. All right, that's all right. right. Those are the things we watched this week.